Good morning. My name is Paul Isbell, um, formerly the Director of Energy at the Real Instituto Elcano and currently the Gulbenkian Fellow at the Center for Transatlantic Relations at Johns Hopkins University School for Advanced International Studies in Washington. My new book, Energy in the Atlantic, The Shifting Energy Landscapes of the Atlantic Basin, um, draws a new portrait of the Atlantic zone as a potential energy giant in the near and medium term future. For example, although our attention has been focused in recent years on the Pacific Basin and our foreign policies in the West have been focused on the rise of China and Asia in general, in recent years, a change has been occurring right beneath our eyes and beneath our noses in the Atlantic Basin, where a once dependent zone in energy terms has now begun a transformation. Today, more than one third of all the oil production in the world takes place in the Atlantic Basin. And surprisingly to many, an increasing amount of this increased production is coming out of the Southern Atlantic a segment of the Atlantic Basin that is now re-emerging itself. Over 40% of conventional petroleum reserves are located in the Atlantic Basin. More than 60% of all the estimated shale gas reserves, the new unconventional resource that is transforming the gas markets globally, is in the Atlantic Basin. In terms of renewable energies as well, it is the Atlantic Basin that stands out as the global leader more than 80% of all renewable energy installed electrical capacity now is in, in the world, now it can be found in the Atlantic Basin. And upwards of four-fifths of all biofuels production and trade also occurs or originates within the Atlantic Basin. What is occurring is at odds with our current emphasis on Asia in our foreign policy. And our current focus on the Middle East with respect to energy policy. It is very, very possible that we are now experiencing or witnessing the nascent formation of an energy system within the Atlantic Basin that has the potential to deepen and broaden itself to perhaps change the strategic equations of many countries in the Atlantic Basin. As what occurs in Asia and the Middle East and in other parts of Eurasia traditionally associated with the West supply of energy will become somewhat less important with time within the strategic equations and the foreign policy formation of the United States, of its European partners, and of allies and um, other associates all across the Atlantic Basin, particularly now in the rising Southern Atlantic where we are experiencing um, an energy revolution, both in conventional and new alternative terms.